Welcome to Liturgy of the Hours with Deacon Kevin. This is a ministry of St. Joseph's Catholic Church in Jacksonville, Florida. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, O Christian people, sing in triumph gladness. God has rescued Israel given joy for sadness. Freed from Pharaoh's bitter yoke, Jacob's sons and daughters, leading them beyond all death through the Red Sea waters. Spring is in our hearts today, Christ has burst his prison, and from three days sleep and death, as a sun has risen. All the winter of our sins, long and dark and flying, from his light to whom we give song and praise undying, now the queen of seasons bright with the day of splendor, with the royal feast of feast far from dark December, comes to glad Jerusalem, who with true affection welcomes with untiring praise Jesus' resurrection. Neither could the gates of death, nor the tomb's dark portal, nor the watchers, nor the seal hold you as a mortal. But today, amid your own, you have stood with bestowing your own peace, which evermore passes human knowing. God so loved the world that he gave his only Son. Alleluia. I will give you glory, O God, my King. I will bless your name forever. I will bless you day after day and praise your name forever. The Lord is great, highly to be praised. His greatness cannot be measured. Age to age will proclaim your works, shall declare your mighty deeds, shall speak of your splendor and glory, tell the tale of your wonderful works. They will speak of your terrible deeds, recount your greatness and might. They will recall your abundant goodness. Age to age shall ring out your justice. The Lord is kind and full of compassion, slow to anger, abounding in love. How good is the Lord to all, compassionate to all his creatures. All your creatures shall thank you, O Lord, and your friends shall repeat their blessing. They shall speak of the glory of your reign and declare your might, O God, to make known to all your mighty deeds and the glorious splendor of your reign. Yours is an everlasting kingdom. Your rule lasts from age to age. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. God so loved the world that he gave his only Son. Alleluia. To the King of Ages, immortal and invisible, be all honor and glory. Alleluia. The Lord is faithful in all his words and loving in all his deeds. The Lord supports all who fall and raises up all who are bowed down. The eyes of all creatures look to you and you give them their food in due time. You open wide your hand, grant the desires of all who live. The Lord is just in all his ways and loving in all his deeds. He is close to all who call him, who call on him from their hearts. He grants the desires of those who fear him. He hears their cry and he saves them. The Lord protects all who love him, but the wicked he will utterly destroy. Let me speak the praise of the Lord. Let all peoples bless his holy name forever, for ages unending. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord, be near to all who call upon you in truth, and increase the dedication of those who revere you. Hear their prayers, and save them, that they may always love you, and praise your holy name. To the King of Ages, immortal and invisible, be all honor and glory. Alleluia. The Lord is my strength. 
I shall always praise him, for he has become my Savior. Alleluia. Come to our aid, O God of the universe, and put all the nations in dread of you. Raise your hand against the heathen, that they may realize your power. As you have used us to show them your holiness, so now use them to show us your glory. Thus they will know, as we know, that there is no God but you. Give new signs and work new wonders. Show forth the splendor of your right hand and arm. Gather all the tribes of Jacob, that they may inherit the land as of old. Show mercy to the people called by your name, Israel, whom you named your firstborn. Take pity on your holy city, Jerusalem, your dwelling place. Fill Zion with your majesty, your temple with your glory. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord is my strength. I shall always praise him, for he has become my Savior. Alleluia. A reading from Hebrews chapter 10. Jesus offered one sacrifice for sins and took his seat forever at the right hand of God. Now he waits until his enemies are placed beneath his feet. By one offering he has forever perfected those who are being sanctified. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. When they saw the risen Lord, Alleluia, Alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The disciples rejoiced, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Good Shepherd laid down his life for his sheep, Alleluia. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm and has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham, and to his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Good Shepherd laid down his life for his sheep. Alleluia. Let us praise Christ, the source of all life and the foundation of all virtue. Lord, establish your kingdom in the world. Jesus, our Savior, you died your human nature, but were restored to life by the Spirit. Make us die to sin and live by the Spirit. You sent your disciples into the world to preach the gospel to every creature Inspire those who preach the gospel to live by your Spirit. All power in heaven and on earth has been given to you to bear witness to the truth. Keep the hearts of those who govern us faithful to the truth. You make all things new and command us to wait and watch for your kingdom. Grant that the more we look forward to the, a new heaven and a new earth, the more we may seek to better this present world. You went down among the dead to bring them the good news of the gospel. Be the great joy and hope of all the dead. Let us make our prayers and praise complete by offering the Lord's Prayer. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. O God, author of our freedom and of our salvation, listen to the voice of our pleading, and grant that those you have redeemed by the shedding of your Son's blood may have life through you and, under your protection, rejoice forever unharmed. 
through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God.